your lovely lady malicious pro saying welcome to another let's play of minecraft so we're gonna turn down the volume on all of the sound and uh, try and build something god something anything uh, in this horrible horrible place freaking pigman uh, he's still in my uh, as let's say he's still in my hole <laughs> Crap. Um. Oh, get out of my, get out of my little cave, dude. So <clears throat> you're probably wonder, wondering, where you been? And um, all I can say is school is going to kick my big oh. Bottom. No! Ow! Ow! That hurt. I'm, uh, taking 16 credits. And. I gotta tell y'all. Um. Ow! Oh, testicles. Um. Like, I'm not the best cook in the world, um, but I love to cook, and um, I definitely had my ego bruised a little bit, so I'm in my catering class, um, and we were assigned positions, excuse me, we were assigned uh, positions in the uh, our organization and the one position that I wanted I wanted to be executive chef and they made me they made me like banquet captain and that's basically a fancy way of saying the liaison between the front and the back so I'm not particularly happy about that and um, it's been a rough, rough week. I between having my ego bruised and uh, having a thirteen and a half hour day at school, it has not been a walk in the park at all. But um, I'm definitely going to enjoy my classes, or at least I'm going to try to enjoy my classes. Not sure how catering is gonna go. I'm already button heads with people. Um, I honestly have a feeling, and I don't want to be rational, rational about things. Rational. <laughs> wow. I don't want to be rational about it, but I have a feeling that part of the reason why I was put in the position that I was put in is because. I mean, you guys have been with me for a while. I'm a pretty, you know, straightforward, no bullshit kind of girl. And, um, you know, I, I pride my, myself on certain things. My, my mad kitchen prowess being one of them. And, uh, geez, hold on. There we go. The other thing is, you know, my ability to kind of take control of a situation. And I think, I think that's part of the reason why they put me in the position that I'm in is because, you know, maybe I need, maybe I need some work in the whole working together with other people, uh, part. I, I, I guess that's a pretty reasonable assumption. But I'm still not happy about it. <laughs> so, and my group members and I are already butting heads over a concept. Ours is the first group. And, um, we have to have a, a theme. And we have to have, and we're doing a buffet. Well, I was thinking, since it's generally fairly easy to make, and that's not me being just. You know, if any of you happen to be Muslim or, or Egyptian or 
where you eat, eat and cook this kind of cuisine. It's not me trying to be, be offensive. Uh, but it's generally pretty easy food to make. Um, in the big scheme of things, I mean, there's, there's a lot of technique, but it's not hard technique. And, um, I'd like to do something like that. So, most hilarious thing this week though, I'm taking a hospitality law class. And, uh, oh, Jesus! First day of class, and I had already been tipped off, so I knew what was going on. But I was told that my hospitality law instructor was going to sit in the back of the class and we were going to have to um, wait about 15 minutes for him to get there. There you go. And so I knew what was going to happen. Yeah, this is what happens when you you network. You you find things out. And. Uh, so I was like, all right, cool. Uh, drama, drama. Leave me alone. So 15 minutes go by past the time when the class is supposed to start. And, uh, this little spinner girl, uh, she's like four foot something, stands up in the middle of the freaking classroom and starts going, man, this shit is whack. You know, I'm like, oh, Jesus. And, uh, And, uh, what is wrong with me? Take me back! Take me back! And, um... You know, she's like, man, this shit is whack! I don't understand! And blah blah blah! And I'm like, oh, Jesus. I know this, this man is gonna walk in and or stand up and, like, tear her a new one. So, I'm like, you know, don't you think you owe the guy a little bit of respect? Wouldn't you want the same kind of uh, benefit of the doubt? Maybe, maybe your car broke down or, or you know, I don't know, freaking, it's been snowing like crazy in Virginia on and off. And Northern Virginians, man, they don't know how to drive with crap. And uh, so I was like, you know, give him the, be give him the benefit of the doubt. And apparently... That wasn't an acceptable response because she was just like, whatever. And so he stands up in the middle of the classroom, goes to his, oh, hey, it's the new update. Hello. And, uh, You know, he points at me and he's like, what's your name? And I tell him, and he's like, I'm gonna like you. And I smile. And I'm not trying to kiss ass, it just happens to be that that's the end result. 
And, uh, he looks at her and he's like, what's your name? And she tells him. And he's like, you know, you've got a, you've got a real big mouth for such a little girl. And I just, oh God, I cracked up laughing. It was hilarious. So, real funny. Uh, I, I definitely enjoyed myself. I want a glass. It was one of the many things that y'all said. Oops. One of the many things y'all suggested. Hey, food? No. Ooh, that's an idea. We've got three buckets. Let's go. Let's go get ourselves some milk. And we're gonna have to somehow find some wheat and stuff. We're gonna make ourselves a cake sometime. Nope, come here, cow. There we go. Nope. Oh. I need cows. There's so many of them. There we go. Sweet. Now I need to go kill some some pigs. <laughs> uh, what have I been picking up? Eggs? I don't even know. Whatever. But um. Yeah, school's been real hectic, guys, and I'm sorry that I haven't gotten a a chance to put up an LP. I just, if I'm not asleep, I'm in class. If I'm in class, then, you know, I'm trying to, trying to pay attention and it's just, the semester is gonna just beat the crap out of me and then, you know, shove me to the side. So, if you guys aren't too disappointed, um, but I promise you, I will try to get more LPs up. I just, I, I'm losing my mind. So. Now, what are the things that we need to do? Do I have wood? I need wood, baby. Alright, I got wood. <laughs> We're gonna have to go on a mushroom hunt in the, uh, the nether. There's a shitload of mushrooms down there. But, uh. That's another way to get food. Make a few bowls. And we'll make some soup. Pew, pew. Beautiful. All right, no, no, no mushrooms. Yes. Dude, soup feels a lot. That's awesome. We're definitely gonna have to go on a mushroom hunt. But um, this is your lovely lady malicious prose, guys. And um, I've still got a minute left. I'll be quiet, or like half a minute. But, um, oh, and the other funny thing was, we're, uh, <laughs> we were in my, uh, my communications class and we're discussing like all this crazy stuff and <laughs> I somehow managed to answer like all the questions right and he's just, my instructor's like, good God, you're real smart. And I'm like, I know it. I know how smart I am. I am just that freaking amazing. And he's like, oh Jesus. So, whatever. Uh, Y'all have a wonderful, wonderful weekend. Thank you so much. And um, I'll talk to you later. So, uh, peace.